brothers and sisters of the celestial energy, it's Brother Wisdom coming to you guys again. Um, I'm, I have been, uh, you know, while I was at work, I have been watching a lot um, of activity throughout our universe. Um, it is important to be in tune um, to the universe. Um, the energy on the planet is extremely, extremely high. Yes, Nibiru is here, but there are other, uh, there are another, there's two other suns that is within our atmosphere. There's a, also a sun as in the north. Nibiru is in the, in, as a, in the west. Okay. Nibiru is all the way west. All right. Nibiru's over there in California. It's all the way west. Um, there are two other suns. There is one that's in the south that um, many can see. And, you know, these inorganic beings want to hide. And there's also one that's in the north. So, uh, in actuality, right now, our planet actually has four suns. Um, the energy is growing greater and greater as we um, go through uh, day by day and uh, all night here at work. I mean, I was like on fire. I mean, my vibrations were so freaking high. Um, it was it was unbelievable. I mean, all night long, the vibrations was just banging, you know, and. I work at night and, you know, sleep part of the day and other part of the day, you know, I don't know what I do. Um, I'll probably, I'll, more than likely I'm going to sleep and then I'm going to head to the gym and, you know, pump some iron, you know, then come back home, get ready for work and, uh, you know, start my day off or whatever. But um, the energy has been extremely high and... It you know I I I I I read some of the comments from brothers and sisters with that that with that uh, YouTube um, that YouTube community channel that um, that last posting that I made and um, I I I need for brothers and sisters to understand that. Someone said, someone said to me in, in so many words to say, you know, yeah, I watch you, da da da, you know, um, and Rashad or whatever would say, or well, at least Rashad is not stressing us about building. And you know what? I'm, I'm gonna tell you this right here. Many of us who have begun the making different things, making different structures, making different designs, building, many of us have a much higher vibrational energy than those who have refused. Like we said, we're going to have brothers and sisters who are going to see brothers and sisters doing great things and they're going to be like, why can't I do that? And they're going to be the ones, you know, it's going to come come back to them. I should have started building like everyone else. I should have started creating. I should have, because you got to understand, you know, and, and this is not just from me. This is from Mother Cosmos. This is from Mother Universe. Our ancestors were physicists, scientists, mathematicians. Yeah, they were musicians as well, but but they they were on a different level. You know, they knew physics. They knew they were they were they were they were uh, 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 true masons. In order to be a mason, you must build. See, a true mason is tapped into every level of true power known. 
people used to say to me here on on this thing, you know, especially those inorganic beings, these orc beings, they would they would get on the bed, you know, like show me what kind of power you got. I'd be like, you know, that's not not for me to show, but I know what I can do. As of lately, I my vibrations have been so high because I have linked into some other things, and I'm and I'm creating some other designs. I'm getting ready to create something huge, brothers and sisters. You, you know, let you guys see it when um when I finish with it. But my I have increased my vibrational energies so high that when I'm at grocery stores. These so-called white folk stop in their track. I'll be coming, I'll be going in the door and they'll be in front of me and they will feel my energy and they will stop and turn around and they will open the door for me. And I say, okay, thank you. I'm like, or either the door will be one of those automatic doors and they'll they'll sense me walking behind them and they'll stop and then they'll just say you go forward i was in the grocery store one day looking at some uh some fruit and they were looking at strawberries i was looking at grapes and these two this this white couple and they they looked at me and they said are we in your way and i'm like no i was looking at grapes they were looking at strawberries but they thought i was in their way but they felt my vibrational energies. And this is the thing about it, brothers and sisters. You have to understand that it is important that you increase your vibrations. You know, people always say, how do we increase my vibrations? How do I increase my vibrations? You increase your vibrations by opening up the geometric gateways, the geometrical gateways that are within you. That is how you open up. That is how you increase your vibrations. That's how you increase your vibration. You can, you know, yeah, at one point, you know, early on as, as as I was, you know, going through the first parts of the lesson, I was learning how to raise my vibration, raise the frequencies within me. And I was, you know, teaching everyone to say, hey, you know, you you can just link into your frequencies and, and you can make your frequencies go higher. Yes, you can make your frequencies go by higher by thinking and, and, and shifting your frequencies within you, but those are just your frequencies but your vibrations can sometime cause your frequencies to increase as well because the vibrations and the frequencies work together the higher your frequencies, the higher your vibrations the higher your vibrations, the higher your frequencies but sometimes you're going to have to go other directions so how did our brothers and sisters raise their vibrations like this crazy crazy level to the point of um flying and levitating because what were they doing they were building and any brother and sister who goes against the 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 principles of the laws of energy all right because you have the laws of energy the laws of energy says that energy cannot be destroyed all right but energy can be created. You know, these white folks say energy can never be created or destroyed. No, energy can be created because you can create a new energy within you by doing something that you have never done before. This is why we talked about building. Like the one brother, you know, I posted a thing on there. And he says, you know, I, I haven't built anything since I was you know young and he's like you know it feels so good and he can feel the energy all around so you know right now our the, the 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 energy is here on the planet but then step that we gotta tap into it you've gotta tap into this energy you gotta tap into this power you gotta tap into this force you gotta tap into this 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 this, this powerful frequency that we are um um, um experiencing at this present moment you've got to tap into it and you know and 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 so many ways you know what we say we, we say build create you know you build and you create i mean my vibrations are so freaking high today i mean it was 
beautiful. The energy, I just felt, just, just like now, I can feel my, uh, my crown chakra just, you know, pulsating. Da, 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 da. I mean, it's just to feel the energy. It's like, you know, it, it's, it's, it's a beautiful thing. So, being, me being Anunnaki and me understanding the, the, the laws, you know, like we say, you got the laws of energy, you got the laws of, 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 of the feminine energy, that's laws of feminine energy, you know, which says that, you know, in order to complete, uh, in order to give birth to a thing, you must pair the masculine energy with the feminine energy in order to give birth to a thing, which means that you have to put in work. If the mother and father of a child don't put in work, then, you know, or if, if, if a male and a female don't put in work, they won't get in a child. Now, all of us are adults here. All right. If a male and a female don't put in work, they don't get a child. So in order you in order for you to give birth to a new vibrational energy, then you must put in work your physical body linking into your your, which is your physical body, which is a masculine energy, linking into your spiritual body, which is your feminine energy. And those who want to be lazy, well, you will have without. You will be without. You will be without. I mean, that's just the way it is. You know, nothing from nothing leaves nothing. But if you have, if you're doing something then you're building and there's so many brothers and sisters I'm, I'm, I'm looking and I'm like wow this is beautiful and you know the ones that are posting you know there's only very few of them that are actually sharing and showing but then I, I feel in my spirit that there are, are even more so yes this energy is here Nibiru is here all the, the other sons are here um, I was watching the video was at, at, at uh, lunch um tonight at work and I was watching the video and it had uh Elon Musk and you know he Elon Musk he literally admitted to be to being an alien I mean he literally admitted to being an alien he says I am an alien is what he said and they were he was talking about something that happened that almost was the demise of artificial intelligence and they had to do something I forget what it was I think they had to raise the carbon dioxide or lower the carbon dioxide something they had to do but basically they had to spray some shit into the sky to save their artificial intelligence bodies alright so we have to understand that by us increasing the level of thought you know that thought itself is so important thought is important thought is important if you think on creating something and then you create it all right that thought is important and you're supposed to act upon your thoughts so yes this vibrational energy is here brothers and sisters extremely extremely high vibrations extremely extremely high frequencies but you can increase your vibrations by working by working all right and i know some of you don't want to hear it some of you don't want to hear it because you know you're like going all you know, i can i can do this and i can do that and i can do this let me tell you something let me tell you something if our ancestors didn't build the structures that they built and 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 create the structures that they create and, and didn't build that system, they would not be have been the most feared beings on the planet. Let me tell you something. This white man fears you linking into science. You can sit up and have lectures all fucking day. You can have lectures all goddamn day. You can talk your fucking head off. I can talk all fucking day and make everybody feel real good like a preacher. All right, and you can sit there and soak up this and soak up that and take notes and all this stuff. But if you don't do a motherfucking thing, you ain't gonna have shit within your spirit. I'm telling you, 
Yeah, you feel good, you feel energy, you feel this, you feel that, you feel this, and you do that. But then the thing about it is, someone said, "Well, how uh, when I when I was telling about the when I did the little short video about um, the gateway opening, I said gateway." Someone said, "Well, how do you how how do you sense that when you have high vibrations from using your body to create?" different things because you got to understand when the geometrical gateways are open up within you you are in tune to nature to the cosmos you can see things happening light years away from here all right as you're walking around you can see things happening all right so this is this is this is this is important this is extremely important. So, yeah, when you when you open up those gateways, you become that power. You become that energy. You become that everything. This white man fears you going into science. He fears this. Because he knows the end result, brothers and sisters. He knows the end result. He knows that you are going to link into some powerful, forceful energy that he'll never be able to link into. And you do this through your spirit and your soul. Your soul can can begin vibrating on a new on, on a new vibration, vibrating on a new frequency. This is how our ancestors were able to do the things we do. And they told us in that in, in, in that wicked, wicked ass Bible they wrote. They said, and we saw these people, these people, these people, wood people, these black folk. And we saw that they were reaching to they were reaching to the heavens, which means that we had we we had powers and abilities that, that were heavenly. And they knew that our system that we had set up, this is what I can't get across to so many hard head young brothers and sisters because they have this idea that they have, you know, hey, you know, I'm, 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 I'm listening and I'm, and I'm watching and they have this bright idea that, well, we got somebody that we can listen to and they can just lecture to us all day. And they can talk about this and that. And we ain't got to worry about that. Let me tell you some hard head ass brothers and sisters. Our ancestors built a system that allowed us to move freely through this planet. And it allowed us to tap into the most powerful, forceful energies ever known. But when this white man came to the planet, the first thing he wanted to do and he wanted to war with us after he found out who we were, uh, he war, warred against us. He said, we're going to destroy this system. Then they destroyed that system and we fell from our powers. We are the fallen angels. We are the fallen angelic beings. And the only way the angelic beings is going to return to the full vibrational force is if we build a system back up. But you young brothers and sisters, there's one one somebody said said on, on one of the things said, um, what did they say? They said, uh, you jealous of, of of Rashad because he better, he more better off than you. Let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. I'm, I'm gonna straighten this shit out right now because that was on my mind. You know, let me I'm, I'm gonna I'm gonna straighten this shit out right now. Ain't no motherfucking amount of money that anybody got can match up with the spiritual energy that's in me, motherfucker. You understand that? Whoever the fuck your ass is, and if you don't like what the fuck I said, you bring your ass to Detroit, and we can we can, we can can sort it out, because I ain't got no problem with that shit. Telling me that I'm jealous because he better off than me? My spiritual energy will literally destroy everything that anybody's got. If I think about it. All right. This is why we gave these orc beings. Six months. They got into August 29th. To prove that their money is more powerful than spirit. 
to prove that their money is more powerful than the than the forces of nature, to prove that they are that their money and their system is more powerful. And what are they doing right now? They can't prove it. The only thing they're doing right now, look what they're doing. They they they're making it snow. We got snow coming down right now. Oh yeah, that's snow coming down right now, and it's cold out here. All right. So all y'all who are lazy and don't want to create, who don't want to build, who don't want to do shit, you just sit back and you watch all of us who are moving into the higher higher realms. Like I said, I lead by example. All right. I lead by example. I'm not just saying it and not doing anything. I'm doing it. And I'm saying it. So our ancestors built a system. Our ancestors built a system of power through structures and and different dimensional uh, 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 things. And this is how we went through portals because they were gateways. And we remember we talked about the Oregon and how the Oregon creates a vortex We had a vortex system. We had an orgone system where we were able to go through gateways and different things. And it was highly radioactive. When we remember we say radioactive, this is radio, radio energy. This is, this is, this is radio frequencies, extremely high radio frequencies made through crystals and metals and all kinds of different other things. So if you want to be lazy and you don't want to do anything, you can unsubscribe because I ain't got time to deal with the bullshit and you want to talk about this and this and that. I don't see so many brothers and sisters talk. You know, when I did that, I put I did that that YouTube uh, community channel posting about Rashad Jamal. And there was so many brothers and sisters defending this guy. And I have never seen as many comments ever. But they're defending, but they do not want to build. They do not want to create. Like we said, you're going to be sitting on the sideline saying, I wish, I wish, I wish. How do I start? And we're not going to tell you anything. We're not going to tell you a goddamn thing because we're going to be too busy building on top of what we already created because this system is getting ready to collapse. Like we said, we must have something already in place. So when this system is gone, our brothers and sisters and our ancestors in the past, we we had we had we built vehicles made from wood that glided across the sky. This was wood that was gliding across the sky. This is the type of intelligence that we had. This is what we have to bring ourselves back to. So many don't want to. Y'all stay with Rashad Jamal. All right. Y'all stay there. Y'all stay there and Steve keep on listening to whatever that bullshit he be talking. Y'all stay with Rashad Jamal. But those who really want to build, those who want to create, stay right here. And you're going to see something great. And you're going to know a new energy and you're going to know a new power and you're going to know a new force. You're going to know a new frequency. You're going to know a new vibration. You're going to know a new gateway energy that's within you. You're going to know this and you're going to feel this and you're going to be a part of it. And those of you who want to go and go to other directions, you stay where the fuck you are. You go ahead and be who the fuck you want to be. Money ain't shit. I'm going to tell you that now. Money ain't a goddamn thing. Money ain't shit. But what real power is, is frequencies and vibrations and energies all over the fucking planet. So y'all stay with the rapper. Y'all stay with the fucking rapper. Just like he said. He said, what did he say in that little short thing I saw? Somebody sent it to me. He said, he said, uh, they, he said y'all going to buy my record? Because some of y'all want to sit up and talk about my lectures. He said, y'all ain't buying my record. You can suck my dick. That's what the fuck he said. And if you want me to to show you, I'll post this shit. All right. So understand who the fuck you dealing with. I am Anunnaki. I am a cosmic prince. I am a cosmic elder. But you ain't got to follow me. You're on your own. Frequency and vibrations are rising, brothers and sisters. We're going to a whole new level of energy and power. Get ready to build your strength and power. 
All right. I catch you guys later. You know the deal. All power to the multi chakra celestial angelic beings. May cast reign with you forever and ever and ever. Much power to you all. And remember, cast brings change, not peace. Mm-hmm.